<laughs> I just always want to do like an Irish jig. I know, every time. It's so good. Freemid. And once again. You forgot his name is Freemid. Forgot his name is Freemid. <laughs> Yeah, you wanted to come here to uh, hang out with Tingle. Check out these statues. There's no statues here. Um, I think I read that uh, the statues are still in the game, but since the Tingle Tuner is not, there's no indication that they are there. Interesting. Yeah. So like, they're still there, but uh, you just have to like get lucky and bomb the right spot or something. Oh, that's bullshit. Yeah. Anyway. And fast sail. Gotta let the fast sail. We are right next to the island we need to be on. Got there? It? Yeah. Hello, fish friend. It's good to have a traveling companion that's not a fucking boat. It's not a way of transportation. Finally, another living thing I can speak to. Ah, oh, Jesus! And King of Red Lions is like, hey, I'm alive. It's barely. Uh, you're, uh, define alive. Yeah, only technically. You can speak, yes. But can you move? You are animate. You are not alive. <laughs> and here's Nose. Give me the pearl. Throw me into lava. Oh, sweet. You can sell this for quite a bit on eBay. I need to take this back to Olimar's ship. <laughs> oh yeah, we did make that connection that they are Pikmin. And now, they transform from Pikmin into... Chows. Huh? Oh. Because they also look like Chows. They do kind of look like Chows. You know what my favorite part uh, of uh, this a little closer. You know what my favorite part of uh, Pikmin is? That. <laughs> the onions. Oh, dude, she's a babe. Yeah, I told you. They transform into babes. That's what Pikmin's true form are. <laughs> <laughs> now I know why Olimar loves that planet so much. But, and boom. But, uh, you know my favorite part of Pikmin? What's that? Is, uh, the onions. Oh, the ships that they come in? Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty, they're pretty cool. Uh, you know what my favorite part is? And, and also the fact that they're called onions. Yeah. <laughs> well, I think they're called that because... Because they, they look, look like, like onions. Yeah. And then at the end of Pikmin 1, when Olimar fucking gets off the planet, and he sees just a shitload of onions. Oh yeah, that's right. He does see a bunch of onions, doesn't he? Yeah. What's your favorite onion? The purple one. Yeah, I do kind of like the purple ones. But there isn't a purple onion. That was the joke that I was going for. Yeah. Good joke. I didn't forget how Pikmin 2 works. <laughs> <laughs> this tower, which the pearls of the gods have caused to appear, is a place that the gods of the ancient world prepared so that they might test the courage of men. And one who is able to overcome the trials that await here will be acknowledged by the gods to be a true hero. Only then will that hero be permitted to wield the power to destroy the great evil. Freemid, that which you must obtain now lies before you. You must believe in your own courage, which has led you to triumph over the many hardships you have faced. You must triumph once again. You must rise above the trial of the gods! I kinda wanna go talk to a fishman, though. The many trials that we've gone through? Dude, we did like two dungeons. Yeah. Ah, there's fishman. Fishman! I am here. For the knowledge which you possess. Got up. <laughs> Here, an offering of food. Yeah. 
yeah, bud. Yeah, Nobody yeah, open yeah. up your seat chat. Reveal. Kind of, kind of cut it off there. In the top <laughs> yeah. <end. laughs> I've done a fish fortune on you, small fry. From what I can tell, it looks like you've faded to come to this place many times. Like two or three. The keys that control that fade are none other than the lucky items known as the Triumph Forks. Yeah, there's some sort of magical utensils. You want to learn more about the Triumph Forks? Talk to that guy, Tingle. What the fish fortune told me. I know I may only be a fish, but my fortune telling is uncannily accurate. Better believe it, small fry. That's all the info I've got to offer. Don't hear it again, you'll have to throw him some more bait. I give him more food. I'm fucking starving here. Alright, hold on, hold on. Hmm? Before you continue. Yes. Take out the camera and take a selfie with the tower. Oh yeah, got it. And switch. And... Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Full sail into this bitch. Oh, I, I, I slowed down. No, okay, now full sail into this bitch. Travel speed. Oh, no, 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 I'm slowing down again. I don't like being slow, I wanna go fast. I wanna be like one of my heroes, Sonics. Yeah, well, what's the point? This is supposed to be a Sonic game, right? Why is it making us go slow? Right. Okay. Alright, never mind then, I guess. I'll just sit here and wait then. I also love that uh, this is a dungeon where you get to use the King of Red Lions. Yeah, only for this room though. It's bullshit. I want him to turn into like a little, little ship in a bottle. Just hang out. No, I want him to get little like uh, spider legs. And he just follows you. Oh god, that'd be creepy. Ah. Safety. I think. There we go. Peace out, loser! Alright, I gotta get rid of you. There we go. <laughs> Why did you do that? There we go. I accidentally hit the button. You're dumb. And you're not playing. So fuck you. Well, you can still be dumb. What does me not playing have anything to do with it? It's totally gonna work. <laughs> I thought I could run off. Guess not! Okay then. Why did you think you could run off? Because it looked like I could probably run off and jump. No. I wanted, I wanted it to explode in the air and be funny. You're at uh, too much of an angle. Yeah, a little bit. Ah, <laughs> uh, was just one of use. Just a jape. There was not another thing, or was there something that I just didn't look at? Okay. Give me your loot. Nothing. You fuck. Here we go. I thought everything else had a secret in it. Fooled me! Probably the map. Yeah. I got a map! Oh god! Trickery is afoot! Eh, peace out, losers. Oh, well. Never mind. That green. Just stay away. No touchies. Why did you swim towards them? So they can get away from the door. Now go down. Go. And we're free. Freedom! Whenever I tell someone to go down, they don't do it. Or you should do it politely. Like, please go down. Slut. Ah, I see you now. Yeah. 
<laughs> there we go. The way, the way you said, please go down, makes me think of, please understand. <laughs> yeah, right. Hmm. Okay. What's that? Cool angle. Yeah, right. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh my god. I don't remember you guys being in this dungeon. There's a lot of them, too. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Ah. Oh. One of these little puzzles. No! One to climb faster. Ah, that's what we put in there. Oh, I'll get you. You're mine now. I'm taking this. Where are we gonna go? Oh, I'm crossing it. I'm shaking, sorry. Hmm? It glows when it comes in contact with a living thing. Must be a very lonely statue. It's a vampire. Did this little statue is a vampire. Yeah. Okay. I believe it. I believe anything, at least twice. Just like uh, Tommy Wiseau's flying car. Maybe Johnny Vampire. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> nope, just, nope, nope. <laughs> just randomly, he wanted Johnny's car to fly. <laughs> <laughs> and and, and uh, one of the producers is like, why? <laughs> Maybe Johnny is Vampire. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why a fucking mystery. Yeah. He, he's fucking great. Is he? Yeah. You know those commercials? Uh, where it's like the most interesting man in the world? Tommy Wiseau is the actual most interesting man in the world. Yeah, what the fuck is going on with that man's life? I wish to know this. Cause like... Uh... He has... He has a uh... Eastern European vague accent uh -huh. that nobody knows where he's from. Uh, nobody knows how old he is. He's a vampire. Nobody knows where he got the money to make this fucking movie. Because <laughs> it was like uh, six million dollars and he paid for it all out of pocket. Out of pocket? Yeah. Like that that little bit of information I did not know. Make it. Make it. Make it. Oh, you suck. Yeah. I mean I can make the jumps, it's just that when it started going up it failed me. Or down. Up or down. Which way did I go? Time I'm gonna wait. It's just gonna go down on me right now. <laughs> Please go down. <laughs> no, nobody wants to go down on you. Oh no! Come on. There you go. And. Yep. Was it Ocarina or uh oh, oh you fuck son off son of a bitch. I thought it stayed lit No it's not lit fam God damn it, you're good. Oh you are a little bit I'm disappointed I look <laughs> just gonna scowl. Yeah <laughs> Uh what were you saying? Uh was it this game or uh not this game. Uh Ocarina or Twilight Princess where like if you left it lit it like burned down. That was Ocarina. 
And Majora's Mask by, uh... uh Proxy. Yeah. I'm pretty sure in, uh... Twilight Princess... Actually, oh, yeah, they, they didn't have no. the torches because you had the lantern. Yeah. I love the lantern, Oh, by the, the lantern's way. so good. You know the best part about the lantern? When you pull out your sword, it's on your hip. It'll be used. I love it. It's great. Uh, I think I love the lantern so much because it reminds me of uh, Morrowind. Oh, was that was that a thing in Morrowind? In Morrowind, you can have a lantern in your offhand. <laughs> Sweet. Whereas in uh, Oblivion, Oblivion comes out and completely gets rid of like lanterns and stuff. You can only have torches. Yeah. And it sucks because it's lame. Well, that's why there's fucking good mods in Skyrim for that shit. Because in Morrowind, you can have, like, you can have little paper lanterns, you can have candlesticks. Oh, fucking candlesticks? Yeah. Like, going around dark hallway, it's like, who the fuck's in my house? Exactly! <laughs> you can be Ebenezer Scrooge. Oh, that'd be great. And die. And die. And I'm slowly being pushed out. Apparently. Die. And now we play the waiting game. <laughs> it's completely unnecessary. Yeah, I know. You could have just had it be a thing where you uh, change the water level yourself, like an ocarina. No, I was like, this honestly makes no sense. If you think about it, that goes to open ocean. Uh-huh. Well, it's like the tide, I guess. The tide in the middle of the ocean. Is there nothing that happens it's in the, the middle of the ocean? It's not the middle of the ocean. It Cause, literally is. Because now it's an island. It, it still just makes no sense to me. And I'm pretty sure tide does happen in the middle of the ocean. I don't know. I have strong doubts about that. Okay, I guess you gotta bring one of them down there. I, don't, I would love to know more about the ocean, and also know very little of it, because it's scary. I don't want to know the possible things oh, hiding that, beneath it. That's the best thing about the ocean. Is, is it? Is, uh, the fact that it's... Like, we, we know more about the moon than we do about the ocean. Yeah, I know. I think, like... I can't remember, I can't remember where I heard it, but I think... I think the total amount of the ocean explored... Is it's only like like three percent. Yeah, like not even five. Insane. No, I don't want to do. I gotta kill all of you. I gotta kill all you fuckers, especially you and the jury. And stairs ascend. And I ascend. Thank you. Oh, the light stairways. They're very pretty. Wish I had light stairways in my domain. Wish I had light stairways just anywhere. Not not in my domain, because, you know, that, that would get old pretty quick. <laughs> like, look at this magical stairway! Eh. Like, like, if you think about it, if you have, like, a unique, like, thing in the world that that's just yours, I imagine you would get bored of it, like, pretty damn quickly. Everyone else is like, oh man, this thing's so cool, but you're, you're just, eh. And I've hung around it for a while, and it's just kind of gaudy. It's been done. Can I not walk in here? Oh, no, it's just a chest. And you! Fuck you! Oh. Guess fuck me, then. So I'll just go fuck myself. Come here. How'd you do that? There we go. And if I remember correctly, you come back with the bow, shoot that, and you get a joy pendant, which is fucking useless. Bow? Yeah. You mean the, the boo that turns you invisible? What? No. Hmm? No. The bow. Lady bow? From uh, Boo's Mansion? No. 
Are you talking about Mario shit all of a sudden? <laughs> Does this look like a goddamn Mario game? No. Kind this of. is everyone's favorite Sonic character, Shadows. When's Shadow the Hedgehog 2 coming out? Seriously. I, that is both a joke and also I want Shadow the Hedgehog 2. I want more Shadow the Hedgehog because he's my favorite Sonic. Like, legitimately. I know he's, like, edgy boy, but he's my favorite Sonic character. Yeah, he's pretty good. Uh, besides Rouge the Bat, but I like her for different reasons. Eh. You fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you! You will not touch me! Ah! You foolish thing. I forget how to kill you. I think I need a bow. You just pick him up and move him. Put him, put him in the corner. Bitch! You get fucked. Well, he didn't take any of my money, so that's fine. All he did was All take right. your pride. Joke's on him. I have none. Give me your stuff. One root. Really? Okay. You fucking somersault down here? <laughs> He's a ninja rat. <laughs> okay, calm down, musical tune. Like, out of all the things in this game, you are so loud. No, it's not actually that loud in the, the recording. Oh, yeah? It's just loud to us. Because of TV. Yeah. Your TV is visual and audio not good. Not in that best thing in good, the world. Good phrasing. I phrase good things. Ah, here we go. Never mind, I lied. Uh, ah, here we go. No. Back off. Come back. You probably need that. I probably do need that. I don't know why you look at it and just immediately ignore it. Cause I like doing double takes. Like, hmm. Huh? How? Ah. Uh -oh. Fools! Uh, fools! Here we go. Seeker of the Goddess's Guidepost, press Zia to call me and guide me to my place of truth. Oh, really? <laughs> I forgot. Yeah. <laughs> Hang on a sec. Hang on. <laughs> Staring right at me. God, my boyfriend is so annoying. <laughs> God, I hate this part. What, the escort quest? Yeah. This time I can just carry you, thank you. Can't carry you, like, through that, though. Just fuck you. One moment. I must take care of some business. Get out of here! No touching me and my boyfriend. Get your own. Get your own inanimate object of a boyfriend. You're a fucking inanimate it's object. It's also a fucking goat. It's horns. It's cool. I like goats. Moving on. <laughs> it's from it, guys. A weird kid. <laughs> you know, in addition to being a fucking serial killer, possibly. And a DJ. The DJ? Yeah. I don't think I remember that one. Does, doesn't Freemed sound like a Swedish DJ? Oh yeah, absolutely. Now that I think about it. DJ Freemed. I am here now. 
Oh, is that the uh, command melody? Yeah. Hmm, specific directions. I shall do this! Dun, 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 dun. That's not it. What? Is it, what? I learned the tune! Oh. My kin wait beyond the doors. Control them. Guide them to their places of truth. Open the path to the gods. What if I don't want to? Then don't, I guess. Okay, bye. Did I still remember that? <laughs> I still remember it. Well, that's uh, the, the wind one, right? What about the earth one? Nope. Uh, what did, how did the wind one go? Pretty sure it was the one that I was humming earlier. Maybe. But I don't remember like the directions for it. Oh, wait. There you go. Yeah, I got it. <laughs> yeah. Come here. Take that. Come here. You want another one? Ah! Dirty bitch. Uh, oh! <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> fucker. Hmm. Oh. Grandpa boy. Oh! Okay, it's just fucking knocked door down that way. Why, they're friends. They're not friends. They're Ghost Rider. They're a Ghost Rider. But without the Rider part. Come on. Yes, I will accompany you, new boyfriend. Where's this guy's horns? They're even more pronounced goatly. Yeah. Uh, his is goat horns, the other guy was ram horns. Ah, that's what it was. Then what's the other one gonna be? Devil horns. <laughs> well, technically they can, they can all be considered devil horns, can't they? I guess. Yeah, but what are they? Oh! I, I messed it up. Hmm? I, I already forgot the fucking man tune. I need to do that. So I stand on this. You learned it like two seconds ago. <laughs> Look, man. It's also right there on the screen. Oh! Never noticed that. Hey, let's just get a look at Formia here. <laughs> so fucking stupid. That's like a Men Talk the Mind Taker. Yeah, right? <laughs> Dude, Menthok's the best. He's pretty good. Yeah. Remember when you got into that fucking mental duel with the Leprechaun? No. I remember very little about Harvey Birdman. <laughs> like, specific things about Harvey Birdman, I do not remember. Well, let me tell you. Mental duel with the Leprechaun. The best. Now I go through. But you. Good. Now, was it was it actually a leprechaun or some weirdo that was dressed like a leprechaun? Either or, way. Or were both? Whee! <laughs> Healing, please. Nope, I don't need money. Healing, please. Nope. Can't buy healing. <gasps> yeah, you can. My favorite, my favorite enemy in this game. Choo choo. Second favorite. Dog Knight? Yes! Why are they called Dark Nuts? I don't know. Oh, you saucy bitch. Fucker. There was a... Uh, <laughs> 
There's a bit that uh, AVG ended where uh, he was just like going through the enemies in Zelda and how none of their names make sense. Yeah, right. Best part about these guys? They fucking fight without a sword. Oh, oh steal his thing. Whoa! Oh, yeah. I are gonna even take their sword. No, I meant his uh, night crest. Oh, yeah. Like fairly! Thank you. And now it's just not honest person. I love that little detail. What, seriously? Yeah. He doesn't have a belt anymore. Yeah. That's what I stole. That's awesome. Yeah. I love this particularly. Who spins first, me? <laughs> it just walks away. Yeah. They're, they're fucking weird like that. Stab your butt. What is he looking for? He's looking for a sword, but he's doing it improperly. Whereas, like, when you knock the Moblin's weapon off, he's like, Where's my weapon? Where's my weapon? He's just, yeah. mm, he, I don't need it. He's, oh, where, where'd my sword go? And then he spots it and then rushes towards it. Yeah. But with this guy, he's just, nope. Mm, nuh uh. Well, that's because, like, he's so cool, he doesn't need a weapon. It's true. There's like two versions of that guy, too. Yeah, there's the, the Dog Knight one from this game, and then the, the Tall Man one from Twilight Princess. No, I'm talking about, like, in this game specifically. There's two yeah, Dog isn't, Knights. Yeah, isn't there, like, a white armor and black armor? No, uh, well, black armor, yeah, I think so. Shoot the thing. Shoot the eyeball. Oh, yeah, I had to fucking get them. You just got a bow. Shoot the eyeball. Oh, no, my eye. Oh. Yeah, you fucks. Yeah, you fucks. I thought you called him Fox. I want to call him Fox. Can't let you do that, Fox. That goat friend still there? Yeah. Yeah. Who told you you could get off the fucking stand here? Motherfucker. I told you before, you do nothing without my consent. <laughs> you are my boyfriend, after all. <laughs> oh. Now they're active. Well, because now you can kill them. Yeah. Now go stand on your thing and look pretty. That's all you're like good a, for. Like a good boyfriend. I mean, we are we are playing Supergirl, right? Yeah, I was about to say, <laughs> just like mon -El. Yeah. Oh god, mon -El. So sad. Like they they gave him that characterization of, oh, you're a hero. I want to be a hero too. And then next episode completely forgets about it as soon as they start dating. Yeah. Man, fuck that show. I know it's terrible. I see. I want to go through this door now. So fuck the goddamn weight system. And fuck you! Don't be an orb. Thank you. That would have, like, partially broken my heart. Good. 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 Got him. I really, I really, First try. I really thought you'd be like, eh. There we go. Perfect. I thought I would fall off. Bye. Let me say he still stands on that platform to this day. Nope. I lied. Please don't just be a fucking joy pendant. Thank you. I wanted it to be a skull necklace. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, well, it's not a joy pendant, but equally useless. Oh, yeah. You remember uh, the last time you were talking about. The uh, 
the mask thing that lets you see enemies' health. Yeah. It's not gotten from Joy Lady in this version. Oh. It's from uh, the Pit of a Hundred Trials. Really? Like both of what you say and to this having nothing? Yes. Huh. I guess maybe it was just a way to get back. Because like, uh... In, uh, in the GameCube version, the, the pit has, has, a You're a, joint a triumph fork. Right. And, like, halfway through, and then at the very bottom, a heart piece. But then, in, they in, swapped it. in this one, they're like, oh, a fucking heart piece? I mean, that's not much of a reward. Yeah, after all that. So, they put the mask in place of the heart piece. That's fine. Well, no. Yeah. Oh. Oh, these fuckers. Hey. Where does this get me? Oh, Husky. <laughs> you good, sir? Oh, oh no! Oh, oh I shit! Open my eyes. The real question is, why did he bite down? Well, because he's built to do that. Because it's like he he starts panicking because. There's a bomb in his mouth. Uh huh. But he closed his mouth. Yeah. Like he could have just spat it out. Oh, treasure chart. Nito. Neat and partially useless, unless it's one of the good ones. Yep. Alright, now I gotta weigh it down. I with, think with fat boys. Yeah, I think I weigh one. Yeah, so go ahead and toss you. There we go. I was like half expecting it to like dip down a bit, just to indicate that from yet is a fat fuck. <laughs> Fly! Come on! Ah, they go outward on side now. Yeah. yeah, those are kind of devil horns. Let's go, boyfriend. Good job, sweetie. Stage proud. Don't make it weird. What? He calls me daddy too. Come on. She. Whoa, whoa. Oh, you fuck. You can, Sam? Yeah. yeah. That's what I like about, uh, like all oh, the enemies in this. Just how they look? Yeah. Like how whiz robes are like two cans and uh, the dark nuts are demon dogs. Dog. They're like a, they're they're fucking Anubis. That's what they are. Yeah. Anubis is cool. Yeah, he is. That's why they made him a dark nut. And he's like, what the fuck is a dark nut? Why am I called this? <laughs> Good. Good. Get it eventually. There we go. 
figured it out. Don't judge me. If you do judge me, judge me fairly. I'm not judging you, I just think you're an idiot. Well, that's a... <laughs> hey, it worked! You got it there. Smooth! <laughs> That time it dipped because you fat ass. <laughs> Weighed down by 99 fucking bombs. What kind of kid carries 99 bombs? The smart kind. Who carries around a desk van? <laughs> this guy ain't got nothing on him. Just 10 caps and a desk fan? Who carries around a desk van? <laughs> Oh man, I love Fallout. Yeah. You know what we should play? Uh, not Fallout. 76. No. Yeah. Is that the one with the Battle Royale? Yes. Oh, we ever play that one? It's Doesn't that also, like, have a fucking demon now? Demon? Like, in the promotional, like, trailers for it or whatever, there was just a demon flying around at, like, what? the end of it? No, it's a bat. That's not a bat. Yeah, Bats it is. don't look like that. It's a rad bat. Just like how there's irradiated fucking cows and deer and ants and scorpions. The bat just looks like a fucking demon. Yeah, but it's still a bat. There's also a fucking giant sloth. Cool. Doesn't it like have its ribcage exposed or something? I don't remember. I just know there's a sloth. Yeah. Sloth are cool. Everyone's like, oh, they're, they're such slow creatures, how can they eat? And it's like, they're herbivores, guys. Yeah. Trees don't move. Who's your favorite sloth? Probably sloth from the Goonies. I was gonna say sloth from Full Metal Alchemist. Yeah, right. Oh, I got both of them. And again! Man, I'm so good with the bow. You're like Green Arrow. I'm wearing green. Ah. The final stretch. Excuse me, sir. And... Blame me. Thank you. Don't be the feather! Good. Hi. <laughs> um, don't need it. Arrows, need it. Oh! Oh, you're... You're the one that aims! You're the one that aims! What the fuck are you panicking for? Just calm down. I'm not panicking. I'm Jesus. No one's panicking. Feather. You Nothing. Slut. Also, a little small thing I keep forgetting about these dungeon areas. Always a fairy nearby. I'm taking you. I'm taking this. This is my fairy now. Everyone go get your own. Actually, no. There we go. I can steal from the boss. Yeah. Oh. Probably my favorite boss in this game. Oh, giant hands. Yeah. There's always a hand boss with Nintendo games. Yeah, I know. Oh, an eyeball. It's got a hand surrounding it. I fought this guy in Super Mario 64. And also in Odyssey, I think, there was a boss like this. Oh yeah, I think there was. Yeah.
Where, where are you aiming with it? <laughs> I love that. And now, it's BAM! Thank you. That just reminds me of, uh, Young Link's name in, uh, Italian. In Italian? Yeah. Link Bambino. <laughs> it is not Link Bambino. It absolutely is. That's, that's fucking japes. Go ahead, do it, see what happens. Haha. <laughs> Dude, can you imagine this thing had a fucking body? One hell of a fucking boss fight. Isn't the tower his body? And he turns into like a fucking uh, Megazord? Did this become specific rim? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's exactly what it would be. Yeah. Yeah, I forgot he does that. Sir, please. Please stop shooting me with the death laser. And dead. Oh, I thought I didn't go in for a second. Backflip for victory. Pass can now be open. Oh, chosen one. Chosen one. <laughs> I'm coming. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love Chosen One. Yeah, every time I, like, remember a movie, or we make a reference to it, I, I just always think, man, we should watch that again. Yeah, I know. And I, I almost never think... We should watch a new movie. <laughs> yeah, right? Because lately a lot of new movies are dumb. Yeah. Still haven't watched John Wick. And we never will. No, we will. I will, at least. I don't well, know about you, you. Well, then you can do that, and you can tell me if it's true that every movie his dog dies. <laughs> I, I'm pretty sure in the first movie, his dog dies, and in the second movie, it doesn't. But in the third movie, he gets a new dog, and it dies. <laughs> <laughs> like that's the whole basis of him going after the bad guys, right? Is that they well, kill his the, dog? In the first movie, yeah. Because yeah. he's like a retired assassin or whatever, and the dog was uh, his wife's. Who is now dead? Oh, uh, okay. And then uh, Theon Greyjoy, unknowingly, like breaks into his house and like robs him and kills his dog. <laughs> like he didn't know it was Keanu. Right. Guys, why the hell is John Wick after us? Uh, I kind of broke into his house. Oh my god! I may and killed his dog. Oh my god! <laughs> Sorry about that one, Pop. Like, you have fucked us! Entirely! It's gonna be a weird feeling. What, to be underwater and be able to breathe? Yeah. Like, I guess it- I guess if you were, like, an aquaman and had gills, it wouldn't feel as weird, but just... I don't know, it's just a weird concept to me. Well, that's because you breathe air. No, we breathe nitrogen. Which is air. And also, we don't breathe nitrogen. We breathe oxygen. Are you just dumb? <laughs> <laughs> My point is, we're in Hyrule now. Like the actual Hyrule. Just like in Breath of the Wild. 
Sure. You're probably wondering where we are, aren't you? Not really. Fortunately, there's not enough time for me to explain it to you now. Once you're able to strike down Ganon with the item you obtain in this castle, all will be made clear. Hmm. Trust in my words! See what awaits you in the castle. What awaits me is death. And constant grayscale. And Anubis Knights. And Moblins. That's what they should have fucking called them. Yeah, right? I'm gonna get you. <laughs> hey, boo boo. God, there's so many enemies in this area. Like, they're clearly fighting. But like, there's nothing around them. There's no one else frozen that they are fighting. Yeah, right. Hey. hey! Need you to listen to me for a moment. Item you seek is hidden somewhere in this castle. Find it, you must find the entrance to the basement. That entrance has been blocked by a mighty threshold firmly sealed to prevent evil from ever gaining access. You know where to search? What do you must do? And it keeps evil from accessing it unless they solve this particular puzzle. Unless they know what the Triforce looks like. Yeah. <laughs> You guys hear about the Triforce? Or the Triforks, I guess they call it now? That's good cover, guys. We just go with that. <laughs> Nobody will ever suspect. Yeah, right? Camera, please. More? Okay. You've gone the other way. Yeah, boss. you went. <laughs> Just went the long way around. Hey, and that's a long way is a more fun way. Also, fuck you. No, fuck you. <gasps> Never. Oh god, I'm trapped. In the nineties. Ah, sweet, did it. statue out of my way yeah couldn't evil just you know destroy that statue yeah it's like yeah they probably don't know the stairs are there but you know someone could probably guess if somebody is just like tear down this castle brick by brick until we find that sword Sir, this castle's made entirely of bricks. Tear them down. Like every every single brick? What do you think brick by brick means? Leave the stained glass though, I like it, it's cool. Oh yeah, I forgot about the stained glass. Fucking Triforce over there. You got Rauru. Rauru. Got Rauru, got Saria behind this one, bitches. Got uh, pillars blocking the way. Yeah, we got Ganon with the Triforce. Or get get the get the sword and then we'll look at all the stained glass. Yeah, yeah. I think they're still in black and white. Or at least uh less color. Yeah. Sepia. That's what it is. I guess we're knighting you? Yeah. We hereby dub thee Sir Freemid. Ah, light! I guess it blinds me. It's not really in my eyes. And probably my favorite part of this entire game. Second to the Great Sea. Just this scene. When the rainbow fireflies show up. Wow, this, ah, this, damn scene, it. this scene looks like shit in this version. Because it ju you can just see the line of change. Whereas in the original, it was like kind of like a fade going out. Now there's enemies outside. We super fucked up. What's that? We didn't take selfies with the frozen enemies. God damn it!
I have this thing though. Yeah! Hmm, what is this sword called? Sabbington. Fee. You got the Master Sword. Legendary blade with the power to repel evil once wielded by the legendary hero himself. And other legendary heroes. Many others. And and the other legendary hero and that other one. And, and uh, then this one kind of made the sword. Even though they said that sages did it. Which is bullshit. Did they say that? Uh, it's, it's said in Ocarina, at least. Yeah, there she is. The babe. Yeah. What's her name? Naburu? Yeah. Naburu. Another babe. Impa. With the fucking boobs hanging out like that. Darunia! Bro! Again, I can get out of here. Daria? I, like, do you know how long I've, or how many times I've played this game and never noticed that these were here? Seriously? Yeah. I never noticed that these were here. The stained glass is like my favorite part of this castle. Yeah, I know. Like, there's fucking, uh... I should get those, uh, stained glasses tattooed all over my body. Don't. Just get the fucking poster. No, I'm gonna get it... Poster? Yeah, that's that's fucking... Like a poster you can get, it's just a stained glass. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, hello, sirs! Hello! No, but I'm gonna get, like, a... Uh, Yakuza back tattoo. Just like Kiryu. But it's gonna be... The stained glass <laughs> from Wind Waker. Now that I have the Master Sword, I do more damage. Especially against living things. Hey, 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 wanna party? Wanna party? Hey, wanna party? hey, hey, senora! Take your body something. Work, 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 senora! Work it all the time. That's the Beetlejuice song. Is it? Yeah. Ah! I forgot that happens when you stab him in the butt. You think electric lasers will stop me? Well, you're right. Turns out you are. I should not be wearing metal. This is the thing in Breath of the Wild, right? Yeah. Yeah, I figured it was. You, uh, if you're wearing metal, or you're, you have, like, a metal weapon. And it's, like, storming. You, you'll start to spark, and then that's a sign like, hey, take this off, idiot. Yeah. No. You have been denied, fool. Denied! I must fight with the bro. Ow, you bitch! <laughs> you fucking... Alright, you wanna go? I'll finish you off right here. Twofer? No. That would have been too cool. It would have been too cool. And Formiet is not too cool. He's too murdery for that. Yeah. He's not too cool. He's still in school. Get it? Uh, he, he, he doesn't go to school. What? There, There's like no school in Outset. Yeah, how do, how do people get educated? Is everyone just homeschooled? Everyone just knows. Is that why the, the moment they're born? Is that why the snot kid is such an idiot? Yep. Oof. But these guys always dropped orbs. No. Oh well. We don't really need the skull necklaces. Anyway. Don't we? Not really. After uh, it's the, just, it's just, the one girl gets rescued. It's just a side thing for money. What we want. These fuckers who always drop orbs. Like, do you need to kill everyone here in yes. order to open that path? Yeah. It's annoying as fuck, but you gotta prove that you're a hero. I hate proving that I'm a hero. I have the sword, don't I? You may have the sword. But can you use it? Yeah. And it's like, how else would I have gotten here? It's a sword, man. It's not that Whoa. difficult. <laughs> Friendly fire, ahoy! Denied. Did you 
just fucking try and stick a stab at me? You stick a stab. Bitch. We fight with honor. Deny! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that thank you. Excuse me, sir, I'll be with you in a moment. I'm just looting the corpses of your fallen comrades. You die. Nope. Alright, all right, for real this time, die. Yeah, seriously. Like, you guys are not my favorite enemy. You! They're uh, my favorite version of Moblins. Oh yeah, absolutely. Really? Okay, well, lose your armor. Get stabbed. Good attack. I win. Come at me, fiend. Aw. I want to finish it off with the spin attack duel. Huh? One more? Down here. Noise. Oh, that was the fence. Oh. Yeah. On both sides. I don't know why. That's a dead end. You can't go through there anyway. Uh, so where's the last one? Isn't that where the boat is? No, we came in through that door. That's to uh, final boss territory. There he is. I challenge you, White Knight. I thought you were gonna mention something about defending girls online once you call them a white knight. <laughs> You're on an anonymous message board. <laughs> She's not gonna fucking date you, bro. Bruh, come on, man. Bro, you post cringe. Cringe is huge! <laughs> then one more? Probably on the other side. Probably a moblin. What is this, symmetry? Not exactly. How dare you! <laughs> Get fucked. <laughs> Face me like a man. Ah, bitch. <laughs> yeah, I can go around pillars too, little bitch. Ah, fuck you! I was just about to block that. This guy's kicking your ass, dude. You were not ready. <laughs> it's Kratos. Yo. And now we are free to leave. You have proven your worth, hero. Now get the fuck out. Get out of my home. You destroyed all my cool statues that came to life for some reason. I don't understand it. Long last, our preparations are complete. You must return to me, so that we can return by the same path that brought us here. I have returned to you. Yeah, I'm, I'm here. Right in front of your face, dude. Do you think you're talking to the stone? What does that say about your opinion of me? <laughs> oh, okay, bye. Now where? Uh, the fucking Forsaken, Forsaken Isle, Fortress? Bruh. Really? Yeah. Uh, We're gonna end this bitch. Can we get, uh, the... What's his name? The cyclone guy now? Yeah, we can. In fact, uh, his Cyclone is uh, on the way there. At the Mother and Child Owl. Which? Yeah, yeah, we can just get the, uh, Fire and Ice arrows right after getting that, too. Because, like, in order to get them, you have to have the Cyclone. Oh, there it is. I forgot it was here. And when you uh, use the Cyclone to warp to Mother and Child, you go Yeah, you inside. warp into the, the Fairy Fountain. Yeah, each time. I remember that. Like that. And that. And that. And that. Please don't waste all your fucking arrows. Jesus Christ. It's fine. It's, like, impossible to miss. There we go. Take that, you 
puny bitch. That was a hell of a boss fight. Oh god, he's huge. It's a heck of an army I got there. Oh, he's tiny now. Oh, good. What an eye. No one's ever been able to spot me in there before now. You obviously have mastery of the air. Now that we've established you're quite the wind waker. Oh, drop. Let's see if you can handle this. Let's see if you can handle this. Oh god, he moved in a pattern. I can't handle it. I told you to go right. You seriously couldn't handle it. <laughs> Yay! Mahoo! In the hands of a wind waker like you, my adorable little cyclones will be as happy as can be. Oh, those adorable? Yes. They're very cute. Cyclone Chan. Very kawaii, that's your name. <laughs> <laughs> Guess I'll head for home now. See you down the road. Looks like Team Rocket's blasting off. Right. Looks like Team Rocket's blasting off my asshole. Good. I don't need you judging you're, me. You're the best Wind Waker there is. I don't need you judging me. Yes. So we can meet the cute Queen Fairy. Oh god, I'm very dizzy! Oh. Young Wicker of the Winds. How did you manage to find this place? I am the queen of the fairy world. I have been awaiting your arrival. Now is not yet the time for us to meet. Oh, really? You still have many challenges to overcome. You seek to protect an individual very dear to you. Yes, I know of her. There's yet another in this world whom you must protect. Come visit my fountain again when you have met that individual. The time has come for you to face new challenges. Now, get fucked, loser! Huh. Because you gotta meet Zeld first. Yeah. Then again, now that I think about it, I don't think I've ever gone here before fighting Ganon. Or Ganondorf, anyway. Oh, that was kind of a bust. Yeah. Oh well. We'll see her eventually. Plus, now we have these cute cyclones. Not that cute. Oh. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Ah, he has come to join the fight. Here, let me introduce you to Cyclone Chan. Just sucks up the shark. He's like, no, <laughs> my friend. <laughs> hey, while we're here, the traitor's here. Hey, hey, no, bad shark. Go to your room in the ocean. Do you guys have rooms? I don't know. You'd have to watch a shark's tail. I think I've seen that movie. I think, anyway. I mean, who hasn't seen A Shark's Tale? Starring Will Smith. As wasn't that the, oh, wasn't that the one with, like, the vegan shark or whatever? I don't fucking know. I think it was. I never watched that piece like, of it shit was a, movie. It was a shark that was part of the Mafia, but he didn't want to be a shark that ate people. He wanted to just be a vegan. Part of the Mafia? Yeah, Shark Mafia. Sharkia. <laughs> All I remember is that the, Will Smith played a, a fish that looked like Will Smith. It did look like Will Smith. I have this to sell. Why, that's... Exotic flower. In real... Yes! Oh, I probably don't have enough money for it. Everyone's favorite boss? Oh, that's fine. From Dark Souls? Everyone's favorite boss that, for some reason, during uh, Plague's first run of it, he said that boss can give you trouble. And it's like, no? Not really. Like, I, I guess if you were going alone and didn't know he could summon clones, that'd be one thing, but if you have the summon dude with you, he can just one-shot him. Yeah. 
I think by most people's accounts, he's the easiest boss in the game. Oh, yeah. There's no doubt about that. Because, uh, I mean, technically speaking, he could be the second boss that you encounter yeah, after that's the right. uh, Asylum Demon. That's true. I keep forgetting that little tidbit that you can just go down there. Yeah, just go straight to Pinley. Yeah, I, I never did. Uh, the uh, the masks that he can give you are pretty good. You can get the the dad mask, dad mask, child mask, mommy mask. Well, there, the uh, there's the giant dad setup. There's yeah. No, there's no giant milf setup. No. Or a uh, hey, giant bag. Hey. Hey! Stop it or I'm blowing up your door. Mm, two can play at the cannon game. I love how the first three shots are them getting their aim right. Just fire over here, way away. Nope. Little closer. Little closer. Okay, now we got you. Yeah, it's like if you've been made aware. But you have the Master Sword. Sword shall shine in the darkness, casting back evil. Then in your hands, none can keep you from rescuing your sister. Do not be afraid. I'm so scared, guys. Where's my barrel? I need to hide in my barrel. Do I need to get spotted? Or do no. I just need to approach this? Approach the door, maybe. There we go. My favorite Phantom Ganon. He's got horns like one of our ex-boyfriends. Oh my god! Do you have an empty bottle? No. I'll take that. Oh! Haha! Stab your what? Bitch! What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Denied! Denied! Denied? Oh, okay. Accepted. <laughs> now I come to you! Oh, that was awesome. You have bested me, even though I can't be killed. I have a question about Phantom Ganon. What's that? Uh, is it just Ganon? Like, remote controlling him? Or is he just, like, a separate entity? Uh... I'm pretty sure in, like, some aspects he's a separate entity. Uh, and what is his relation to Dark Link? Where's that lore? Yeah. Sorry? Oh! Use a hammer on him. Yeah, the hammer's real good. Hammer. Time. Reserve! <laughs> <laughs> Did you use also wobble? <laughs> Alright, let's go. But, uh, can't you, like, flatten the little imp fellas? Oh, you mean like this? <laughs> Couldn't really see it. Yeah, hang on. Yeah, I can do it. <laughs> he <laughs> gave up! <laughs> Just move on. Yeah. There he is. Observe! <laughs> he fucking blinks. He's like, wait a minute. Hmm. And like, there's... Like, barely anyone even in this goddamn place. Just 
surprising. Like, when I played through this, I thought there would be like a whole bunch of enemies to take care of, but no. It's just some random dudes and those fucking Bennett guys. Oh, I'm gonna smash you. Did it. I said I was going to, and then I did. You're welcome. You saucy bitch. Bermid, man of his word. Yep. Ruth. Is it going the right way? Should be. Yeah, going the right way. Who knows? Not me. Yeah, good. Good job, statue. Uh, go back. Take a picture of that statue, because that guy's cool. That's pretty cool. Selfie ties me, statue. Is that how that commercial goes? Sure. Ooh. Whoa! Yeah, that's why I can't, like, get a good selfie of him. Damn, that sucks. I also love that his nose twitches like he's like... Intruder! I smell your cunt. Let me smell that pussy. Hello. Goodbye. You guys are a lot less intimidating now. I'm just rolling past you. <laughs> You're lucky I don't have my barrel to hide in. You guys would be so finished if I could hide from you. You're so lucky I'm not a coward now. In the sense that I'm not going to fight you to begin with. I'm just going to run away. Like a bitch. This isn't helping me. I feel like I'm hurting my case. Yeah. If anything, I feel like I'm demoralizing myself. Cool music. Yeah, right? Oh, what? Let's go. What are you doing? Oh. Huh? I forgot about that bitch. He just, will shoot you. You just go. I don't think I can make it. Dang it! Yeah, I know. Alright, let me hop down and turn Oh off. my god, are you fucking serious? Let me hop down and turn off that fucking spotlight. Which one is it? Why did you not hop down to the shortcut? way to get to it. I didn't see the shortcut way. Oh my god. Serious, bro? I'm gonna go through this whole fucking place again. Relax. I mean, we are running on a time limit here. Yeah, but it's not gonna take the entire time limit. I think it will. I don't think it will. I think you're just talking some uh, straight up shite. Hey, friend. Really? I should have, like, flattened you. Good. You're gonna hurt. Yeah, thank you. Alright, that's the one I need to destroy. Which I can get to from that side, I think? Yeah. Should be able to. What are these little imp fellas? They're just little demon boys. Doing demon boy things. Like hopping around going Bennett? For some fucking reason. Bennett? Yeah, Bennett. Like the character from uh, Heroes? Uh, no. Not like him at all because he is cool. These guys are not. Yeah, no. Denied. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna try it again? Just go, man. Go. We don't have time. Maybe you don't have time. We have to save our sister. Right! That's why we're here! To okay. save the sister! And her name is... 
Mm. Bennett? Mm. From Heroes? Yeah, Bennett. Yeah! Or, uh, what's his name? Bennett Foddy? <laughs> Mohinder. Who was Mohinder again? He was the guy. Oh, yeah! Like, I'm not saying that as a joke, I'm saying that as I really just now remember who Mohinder was. And he was pretty cool. And then so he, he got, got, like, the most boring superpower. Yeah, he just got super strength. It was better when, uh, the, the super serum didn't work and he turned into, like, a weird monster man. Yeah, didn't he, like, cocoon himself or something? Yeah. And, like, several people? Yeah. That's what was great about it. Yeah. What was your favorite moment in Heroes? Don't say when season 3 ended. I don't even remember what the ending of season 3 was. Uh, everyone's on Mars or something. What? Oh, I know. It's everyone went to the future, I think, right? What? I don't know. Are you talking about Heroes or Lost? Heroes. Yeah, everyone on everyone Lost was on Mars. That's that theory. Yeah, they also all went to the future at some point. I think that was weird, man. Shut up. Yeah. Uh, I liked when, uh, whenever they see the future. Like, uh, whenever, like, it shows. I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, because you put it on the R button and you're constantly. Are you fucking kidding me? It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Don't worry. Everything will be explained. Anyway, <laughs> I liked when they showed what happens in the future, and then you get to see future Peter, and he's all cool, and he's got, like, scar on his face, and he's, like, a badass guy. Remember that? Yeah. Remember when future Peter came back in time and uh, disguised himself as present Peter and then tried to assassinate Nathan? No. I do. Remember that one, uh... No. Sir, please. No. Sir, please! Fuck. No! God damn it! Are you fucking kidding me? I hate these fucking things! And they just taunt you with their bananas! Oh god, this place sucks on the second run. Pizzeria. Anyways, heroes. Yeah. Twofer! Remember that time when uh, Peter's dad showed up, stole all of his powers, and then was like, You should join me, son. Yeah, right. Remember the, uh... Uh, I don't think it was post-apocalyptic future. Where, uh... All of the futures were post-apocalyptic. Yeah, but this one where, uh, Peter's... Or, is it Peter? Yeah, Peter's girlfriend gets trapped. Yes! <laughs> Alright, here, here's the thing with that, right? It, so, it was like a no, 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 shut something. up, shut up. Writer's block, it's a writer's strike. Same thing. But, shut up. Here, here's, here's the thing with that, right? So, uh... They were from the past. And they went to the future, and then it's a bad future where there's, like, a, a disease that is killing off, like, 80% of the world's population or something. Right? Mm hmm So, uh, they get quarantined, right? They're separated, and Peter is currently not in full control of his powers. So, uh, they went to the future together... But then they got separated, and then he went back to the past, and she was in that future. And then, Peter, still in the past, changes the future. And can no longer access that future to save his girlfriend. <laughs> she is trapped there with no way to return. Now let me ask you something. Uh-huh. This future that she's trapped in, is it in the 90s? No, it's the future. The 2090s? Bye. 
I think it actually might be, like, present day at this point. Don't you fucking do it. <laughs> you fucking asshole. You fucking imps. Getting far away from that edge. Yeah. There we go. They're probably not even called imps. Do you think they would be called Ganonites? Like, Grablacks? Grabors? Gotcha, fuckers. Rabbinites. I'd call them tremors. Don't. Yeah, I just call them imps. Yeah. That's what they, they look, look like. Imps. It's got fucking bird PTSD. <laughs> <laughs> Big bro. What's up, buddy? Oh man, the hot girl. Which one? Because none of them are hot. Excuse me? You're, you're only saying the hot girl because she's rich. Ah, oh, the hot girl! Oh, Gonzo? <laughs> How did you guys even get here? Oh, uh, they have a ship? Duh. What? And also, in order to get here quick enough, they all catapult each other, like they did to you at the start. Okay, it didn't do that this time. That sword! In the original version, whenever he turned around, every single time, the sword would shake, like, visibly. And I'm, oh. and I'm just like, why is it doing that? It's reacting to her power. Now we'll just take these girls and, you know, start our harem. This one's mine. <laughs> he just walks out with a bunch of seagulls. Can I keep them? Oh, just Tetra, look! <laughs> He's like fucking Ed with his chickens. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Now we get to fight the giant bird. And teach it just who's the giant bird in this relationship. Fucking look at him standing there. Yeah, he's very determined. Gonzo, excellent, you're just in time. Take this one for me. Oh? It's fine, do it. Goddamn mook. What was he even gonna complain about? I, I guess... That she's not one of the reward girls or something. She's too young to be in a harem. True. He's taking her though because of the seagulls. Yeah, that's what he really wants. Yeah. Because for some reason, seagulls just love the little sister. Weird. Oh, right, I gotta get the grappling hook out. Oh no. Oh no! Hello. Hello. I'm the Helmorok King. The King of Helmoroks. Huh? She do I even need the grappling hook? I only need it if he destroys some parts of the bridge. Yeah, like that. Okay. Yes, hey, sir. Oof. Yeah. You gotta speed up here, son. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Get fucked. Really doesn't want me climbing. What's his problem? The problem is that he thinks I'm. Oh, you wanna fucking go? You wanna fucking go? Oh, my noggin! You have defeated me! Now by all logic, he should be drowning right now. He's a water chicken. Excuse me? A chicken that's water. Breathable. What, you mean like seagulls? They're basically water chickens. 
Now for probably the coolest entrance to a boss ever. Speed! Fabulous! And also potentially bad for me. Alright, motherfucker. I'm going to wreck your asshole. With this hammer. Where you going, you little bitch? Come on. Are you gonna try and slash at me now? Nope. You're just gonna repeat the pattern because you can't learn. Ah, I really thought it would work that time. Oh no. Maybe I'll do it again. Why How is, is this happening? Working? Fine. I'll fly away. Think of a new plan. Maybe I'll just go pick up some Anubis Knights and drop them in. Yeah. I have a new plan! New plan. Same as the old one! I'm gonna thrash! And then... Thrash! Really? Okay, well fuck you then. Thrash is my least favorite Pokemon move. Uh, I think Dragon Rage is my least favorite. Why? I just... I... Don't much care for the set damage. Thing. Does 40 HP every time, so if you know that uh, the Pokemon you're trying to catch has more than 40 HP, you just blast it. I guess. Like, doesn't it? Doesn't like? Doesn't it still get like critical hit chances? No, it does 40 HP every time. Hey! 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 That did nothing to me. Can you do the thing? Thank you. Now die. He is a chicken. Yeah. He's an adorable giant chicken. And... Nope. A little off. Oh, you should take a selfie with him. <laughs> I'm not gonna try to do that one. You should have got it when his head oh, was stuck yeah. in the ground. Well, I don't know how long you can keep it stuck without the helmet. And then for some reason, he explodes. No, a light show into rupees. He explodes, and his entire being is condensed into a heart. He explodes and he becomes coins, and we get a bunch of points. Dude, that's like the biggest question I have with uh, Scott Pilgrim vs. the World. Why? It, is everyone else seeing these people turn into coins? Yeah, that's just the world we live in, man. I'm scared of this world, because like, someone holds out a quarter and it's like, that used to be a person! You just don't get killed. See? And stop pressing the R button. But I had to get my selfie stick ready. Killed my chicken. I liked that chicken. Been a while, boy. Done well to sneak into my fortress and wriggle your way all the way up here. I suppose the least I can do is commend you for your reckless courage. My name is Ganondorf, and I am the master of the Forsaken Fortress. Why did he have that reaction? Yeah, right? By the way, boy, when you drew that sword of yours out of its pedestal, did you by chance notice how all of the monsters frozen in time down there suddenly began stirring again? You understand precisely what that means? I highly doubt you do. Foolish child, while that sword is indeed the blade of evil's bane, at the same time it has long played another role. You see, it's also a sort of key 
most wretched little key that has kept the seal on me and my magic intact. He's that face. Yeah. By withdrawing the blade, you have broken that seal. Yeah, well... Stab! What are nah, you doing? son. <laughs> You're like knee height. I can punt you. Oh, that's the bigger sword. You cannot defeat me with a blade that does not sparkle with the power to repel evil. What you hold is useless. Go back to the world below and tell that to the pathetic fools who made this blade. Its power is gone, and its edges are dull. Hmm? Freeman, get up! I kind of don't want to. Ugh, stop! Let me go! You found her most vital point. The neck! Why is this four-year-old speaking to me? <laughs> Who is this lost sassy child? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Uh. Uh. Nani! Triforce of power is resonating. Ah, at long last, I have found you, Princess Zelda. What the fuck is this guy talking about? What are you talking about? I don't know any Zelda. Feigning ignorance will gain you nothing. Tell me, if you are not Zelda, then why do you have this fragment of the Triforks? Did you just say Triforks? Maybe. Like, that's just what everyone calls it now. <laughs> it the fuck? A bunch of birds just swoop in? We have birds now? Oh, He's you... very confused by this. Oh. What a fucking dragon. First you kill my bird, and now you show off your birds. Real class act. He's just standing in the fire is like, I don't like this new world. All right, game over. We did it. Roll credits. We killed him with fire. Best way to kill any witch. What? No, you kill witches with water. But burn the witch. No, you you splash water on them, and then they just go. I'm mounting, you son of a bitch! You goddamn bitch! You've killed me. Good. I love the cutscenes in that fucking game. <laughs> yeah, it's so good. <laughs> it's one of the best Zelda games. It's only because of the cutscenes and nothing else. Holy shit, you can see the fucking Big Dipper. And for some reason, one of the stars is like fucking blood red. It's the Blood Moon. What is a star? Link, the Blood Moon rises once again. Oh, cool. It's not like the first. It's not like that's the first time you said it. Where something cooler happened than just respawn everything. I wish the fucking cutscene didn't play every single goddamn time. Well, how else are you supposed to know it's a blood red moon? Link, blood moon rises once again. Listen, how are you supposed to know that there's a blood red moon if she doesn't tell you every time? You just look at the blood red moon. You just see it and it happens. Oh. Ah, my butt tingled. Why is this in my butt? Rumed, what are you doing? Just come now to the room where you got the master sword. Just using that stone. Just who are you? Rumed and I are the only ones who can speak through this stone. How dare you use what not's yours? <laughs> Your name is Tetra, <laughs> correct? <laughs> yeah. Why'd you flub like I do? I don't know. <laughs> I did. Talked like a Squisgar for a second. You don't use what's not yours. <laughs> <laughs> tell you, I love how Squisgar talks. <laughs> Toki looks in your basket. You got tampons. 
See you on your period. Cause you're, a girl. you're gonna go to the bathroom and talk to the other ladies about your lady problems. Your lady squeeze car. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> Oh god, I love it. Oh, Metal Ocalypse is a great show. Yeah, I know. And the music is fucking sweet. The music's pretty good. Whoa. Who's this scrub lord? It's Ganondorf! Are you him? Are you the one who was speaking through my stone without my permission? Answer me! That stone is an enhanced version of the Gossip Stones long spoken of in the legends of the Hyrulean royal family. I am the one who made it. You made it? The royal family's gossip stone? Oh my god, what a liar. I'm sorry, but I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> For me, it just looks at her like, why are you talking like that now? Have neither of you heard the tales? Tales of the kingdom spoken of in the legend of the gods? Lore! This place is that kingdom. Yes. I don't know why you decided to start this up when you could see what time it is that... Like, we have to stop. Oh, fuck, I forgot, honestly. I am its king, Daphnis Herbert. Uh, do you not recognize my voice? It's me, your boat. I am boat. No need for me to reveal my true identity. Is Come on, just, just yeah. go, go yeah. through it, please. Like, Bas we, we know what it is. Yeah. Basically, he's like, yo, I couldn't stop him, so I turned into a boat. And then decided to help you, I guess. <laughs> also, we wished for the gods to seal Hyrule, and they just flooded everything, and it's like, okay, thanks, I we, guess. We asked for them to stop Ganondorf, and they decided to just flood the kingdom. Fucking assholes. The best way to stop Ganondorf from ruling the kingdom is to destroy the kingdom. You didn't Which win! I guess makes sense, but <laughs> you're still a dick. <laughs> And also, you broke the Triforce of Wisdom into two pieces. Triumph so that, Forks. Yeah, Triumph Forks into two pieces. He had the one piece and she had the other piece. One piece. I should watch One Piece. <laughs> and then she's like, oh, this Ding. is how sex is done. <laughs> <laughs> and then magical energy transforms her into a princess, which is weird it's just like here's a costume yeah it also makes her paler oh my god it does make her paler yeah i hate it because uh zelda in this game is meh but tetra is yeah tetra's the best awesome and then like at the end when she reverts back to tetra she's tan again yeah it's so dumb you are zelda Princess of a dead kingdom. Da, da, if, da. if you are a princess of a kingdom with no subjects, are you still a princess? Sure. Makes sense. I think that's a uh, like a pretty like metal, like Dark Souls title for like a boss would be like King of the Dead Kingdom. Oh yeah. <laughs> Isn't that what? Uh... Wolnir was, basically? Oh, I guess not, because he was just, like, sealed there, I think. He was, uh, what we might call a lich? Yeah. We found a lich! <laughs> <laughs> Why are you spooking around? What I want to know is this. Why a boat? Why not an airship? Or something? Something that you don't need a sail. I mean, you still have to sail an airship. No, you can just be an airship. You're gonna run off the magic of the piece of Triforce you have in your fucking hand. Every time they're like, oh, the Triforce is an object of unlimited power. Okay, well, power the airship then. Yeah, use it to do stuff. Yeah. Instead of sealing it away all the time and just using it to make a wish. Yeah, right? Listen, if Ganondorf can use his to become basically immortal, like, he can't die. Every time they seal him, he just gets out. Just... He can do anything with it. Yeah, why can't we do that? Anyway. 
We're gonna st we're gonna stop it here because the moment I leave, he's gonna tell us what to do next. And I don't want to do that I now. Don't care. <laughs> I'm done. You killed Tetra, you asshole. You seriously? That show's cool. Zelda's not. <laughs>